Welcome to the Multiplication Course. My name is Steve Wyborny, and this is Mystery Structure 8. How many cubes? How do you see them? This is Mystery Structure number 8. This mystery structure comes with two questions. How many cubes are there? And how do you know? Pause the video to answer two questions. How many cubes are there? And how do you know? Let's continue by seeing how some people break this structure apart. Here are four copies of the structure. One way that some people break this apart is to see a group of six, another group of six, another group of six, and then a group of three. Another approach is to find groups of three. I'll count the groups of three. One group of three, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are seven groups of three. So there also must be three groups of seven. I'll show where some people find three groups of seven. Here is one group of seven, two groups of seven, three groups of seven. Another approach is to begin with the top and to find that there are seven on the top. Then to notice that there is not a group of seven in the middle, but there is one on the bottom. However, to get to the group of seven on the bottom, some cubes need to be removed, these seven cubes. By taking those out of the way, we can see a matching group of seven on the bottom. So there are two blue groups of seven, and there is also a red group of seven. So altogether, there are three groups of seven. Let's take a second look at how the structures were broken apart. Almost every time we find that there is more than one way to describe what we see. The first structure can be described as 6 plus 6 plus 6 plus 3, or it can be described as 3 groups of 6 plus 3. The second structure can be described as 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 or it can be described as seven groups of three. The third structure can be described as seven plus seven plus seven, or it can be described as three groups of seven. And the fourth structure can be described as seven plus seven plus seven also, or it can be described as three groups of seven. Can you see it several different ways? You can pause the video on this screen to try to find even more ways to break this shape apart. Now, get ready to draw, because in the next video, we'll use paper and pencil, and I will show you how to draw this three-dimensional shape. This is the Multiplication Course. My name is Steve Whiteborning, and this is Mystery Structure 8. How many cubes? How do you see them?